Great, thanks. So this is real software of S16 Touch UI. It's running on my PC and we are using this kind of external touch display to, to present how it looks like. Just because, an emulation, right. Uh, yeah, so because we cannot show the actual devices on behalf of our customers. But this gives you a basic idea what Touch UI is all about. So in practice you can tap anywhere on the screen. You can use finger or stylus, it's totally up to you. Uh, so if you tap the clock icon it will take you to clock application. It gives you a fast access to, to important things. Uh, similar manner if you tap the, the status area there you can quickly change the profile for example to silent. And, and also the other active idle shortcuts are, are work in similar manner so that you can go to your most important applications with just the one click. But if you go to the contacts application and if you have a very long list of, of names in your contact list you can just quickly browse through the contacts with this kind of a fast scrolling so uh, it's easier to find the, the contact you are looking at. Um, so uh, similar kind of a uh, gesture interaction is, is also available in the, in the web browser. Let's go there. If this place have a network, because this is quite crowded, right. crowded place for for web browser. Well, now it starts to download. It's just so slow because of the connection. More phones okay. per square inch in this place than anywhere else on Earth right now. Yeah. So this is the web page, and then you can just hold down your finger uh, on the web page, and you get this kind of a ball which you can move around the page. So it's easier to easier to scroll and see the whole page right. with this kind of a scrolling method. And then similar similar interaction is also available in the, the photo browsing, so you can just wipe to the next image uh, with the finger. But otherwise the idea is to really keep this user interface familiar, because so many people already know how to use S60 UI, so they don't need to start from scratch. And, and because we are still doing uh, soft key-based interaction uh, user interfaces, so now we are providing just more alternatives to make really different kind of a devices.